Alrighty, what's going on, y'all? So, on my Aaron Black 50% wall combo, I had a user by the name of Clash with Ram, I believe his name was, request a tutorial. And basically, I figured what he meant was kind of show you the buttons, show you the timings, and just sort of, you know, break everything down. So, as you can see, I have a lot of commands up there on the top left. But, in case you can't see them, let me show you. So, if you want, now this combo will work off of the uh, 2112 string as well as the back 3-3. Three three. Um, how, and on most characters, it will work off the uh, overhead low string. However, if you're going to burn a bar for a launcher with overhead low, I know this isn't the combo that I'm going to be demonstrating, but if you want to burn a bar for the overhead low, you need to do, whoops, you need to do that because against female characters at least, watch what happens if you try to do the down back four. Yeah. Because since characters like Melina and Jackie and I'm sure other female characters have slightly sm smaller hitboxes, uh, for whatever reason, that launcher will not hit off the overhead low string. So you either want to do that or, whoops, there we go, or that. However, that will change your juggle a little. But anyways, I'm going to be sticking with the back 3-3, three, three, just, you know, actually, you know what, you know what? There you go. You have the proof that it also works off the 2112 string. Now, I'll be sticking with the back 3 3 just because it maximizes his damage. Um, and then basically, I'm going to do the down back 4 launcher. But as I said, just for safety and honestly, since that is plus on block in a real match, you should go with that because it's safe. And on top of that, it's far more likely to hit because I want to say, yeah, if you happen to start too far away, then that might whiff. So things to keep in mind. But we'll talk tech another time. Right now, we're just going to maximize damage. So moving on, we're going to do back 3-3 three, three into EX down back 4. Regular down back 4 works fine. This is just to maximize damage. After that, we're going to do a standing four into another one. Again, regular works fine, just maximizing damage. After that, we're going to do another back three three into standoff stance two. And then finally, we're going to end it with the trusty two one one two two string into the sand tackle. All right. So without further ado, oh, actually, yes, more ado. I'm also going to be using EX Caltrops just to kind of show you the max damage that this can do. But anyways, let's, let's get started. Okay, so I was too late on my standoff stance launcher, which is why it whiffed. Let me try again. That time I was too early, so... My button just came out weird. Again, too early. I don't even know what happened there. Oh my god, I just did a practice recording and got this a bunch of times. <laughs> I'm not good. And that time I tried doing 21122 two too early. For the most part in this combo, what will screw you up more than anything is trying to do stuff too early. Especially after the down back four launcher. But let me try again. Yeah, see, that time I tried to do standing four too early, so all I got was an empty launcher. 
All these failures are good for learning. Again, too early. Too early. <laughs> I look like such a scrub right now. Let me try again. <laughs> I'm so bad. Oh, don't pay attention to that, kids. I'm not good. Yeah, so this is part of the reason I wanted to use Melina. Because against male characters, that usually will connect with that timing. But since she has the female hitbox, she's slightly harder to hit, which means you have to really, really be on point with that 21122 stream at the end. Let me try again. There it is. Like your new holes. And as you can see, with EX Caltrops down, you get 53%. Obviously, it's, you know, questionable whether or not your opponent will fall for that. But for exhibition purposes, I just wanted to show you guys. Uh, some of you, if you've watched the video, you probably wondered why I didn't bother burning the bar. It's because it only gives you 1% extra damage, so I figured it'd be better to just kind of show efficient meter use with that. But anyways... Um, I hope that you were able to sit through all of my failings. Uh, basically, like I said, what will screw you up more than anything is trying to do stuff too early. At least for pretty much the first half of the combo. Uh, after that, though, you do need to be on point pretty much once you get to the back 3 3 standoff shot and then the 2 1 1 2 2 string. But, anyways. I think that's going to do it. Let me know in the comments if there's any further clarification needed. And thanks for watching.